Hello, this is Tim from Instead of Shaving, and uh, this is Minecraft. Now, from what you can tell here from the name of the world, I've been working on a uh, duplicate of Baron Castle from Final Fantasy 2 or 4, depending on what country or version you're playing. Um, let me just show you the floor plan here. I started with the top right of the castle since it has the lowest part of it to it here. Obviously, I couldn't do the one square stairwell. I had to do a full spiral staircase. But it's fitting the floor plan just fine, so I'm not really too worried. Now, this is the part where whenever you finally get access to it, after you become a paladin, um, you get pushed back by a magical force. So this is that hallway right beneath that tower. And then whenever you come back with Rydia in your party, you just kind of walk right through and come down here and fight Odin to uh, get as a summon for your party. Now, there are a few things I think that are wrong with this basement. I don't like, I gave it a dirt floor because, you know, it's a basement. It's not going to have the same wooden floor, but I might give in and give it the wood floor treatment. And plus, the throne looks ridiculous, but, you know, Minecraft has limited textures, and, um, you know, I thought this would look good. It really doesn't, but I'm just going to deal with it for the time being until I come up with another idea or I get, like, a better suggestion or something. But, anyway, moving on. I got... I have it set up so that, you know, we got wood flooring. It just kind of sucks into that. And it does that with every every time there's a floor transition. There's the... You know, the wooden staircase that matches the floor and then stone ceiling into wooden floor. Because I just thought it would look nicer that way. And plus it'd make the towers taller. It'd give the castle more of that feeling of being gigantic and huge. Because, like, everything was made to just be kind of fluffed up a little bit. So, you know, this is that treasure tower. You know, that one on the top right side. And I think this is the coolest part here is there are windows all around the top, so you can just kind of survey your territory. Actually, it's getting dark, so we better hurry this up. But, uh, and out the windows here, you can see, where are they? There. Uh, one of my markers there, because I actually was, I'm playing on Peaceful right now, but whenever I played this, um, uh, before, whenever I started this castle, it was on a difficulty level, and, you know, monsters kept showing up, and I didn't have a shelter built yet, I couldn't find any pool, and, uh, I ended up getting lost and losing all my stuff. And, uh, you know, and then I, I also obviously made the wall that connects the towers. Now, this tower you never explore in the game, but, you know, it'd just be a waste of materials just to fill this with cobblestone and call it a day. So I just kind of built this the way I built the other tower, and I can use it for something. Just put an entrance in. Like, for now, it's going to be sealed, because I don't really know how I'm going to deal with a point of entry to it since the walls attached from that corner and this corner like this side right here where I even go into it so the wall is going to have to be the door is going to have to be in like a corner or something which is going to be kind of awkward and look awkward so I'm not really too worried about that um the reason why I'm making this video now is because I actually ran out of uh cobblestone so since I ran out of parts to build with I'm just going to kind of present this to you as it is. Now, here's the mine where I've been getting my cobblestone out of, which is really odd because all I've been getting out of it is dirt, cobblestone, and gravel. Like, just look at the size of this here. You know, the scope here. I know it's getting dark, so it's a little harder to see, but it's still visible. There has been no coal, like no coal in here. No iron, no coal, just gravel, dirt, and stone. Which is kind of weird. It's like the one place I chose to dig in, and there's like nothing down there except for like bare elements. Which is fine because the cobblestone is what I really need because, as you can tell, I use a lot of it. Like, since I'm out of cobblestone and almost out of coal, actually, I found a cavern where there's like a random, a random uh, furnace and a random crafting table just sitting there waiting for me that I use to like mine gold that I found randomly but like I have three furnaces here that are usually going all the time making stone and then I have my two chests for my stuff here uh I didn't know about the chiseled sandstone see I haven't played since uh the game was actually released so I missed a lot of the changes like the shears um the shears are new to me too 
Ooh, I'm near a spooky place. Anyway, the shears are new to me because you can cut grass and st like stuff and shear sheep and everything. And they're actually really awesome because they work really fast whenever you're working through heavy brush. And all the biomes that I spawned in for... Look at this. Just deep trees. So it's very handy for me. Got lots of wood, obviously, again, because there's lots of trees. And the, the, the stone that I cook a lot of because that's like my primary building material. And I lucked upon some TNT and some orange and blue wool from a, from that place where I found the chiseled stone. It was just this big weird building. Um, but yeah, that's the the Baron Castle. I've been kind of using Minecraft as a stress reliever recently, and I'm kind of getting back into the addiction. And hopefully, I learn uh, more about what changes have been made because I haven't really been uh, doing anything different than I used to. But uh, we'll see what happens and. Um, there was something else I wanted to bring up, and I, I did a take of this video before, and my audio was, and something was wrong with it, and I forgot about it again, so that'll probably be in the next video. Oh, um, I was actually doing a, uh, I was attempting to do a, a video series on how to play Minecraft and what I went through to make the Baron Castle, but... I had like five and a half hours of footage. I was going to speed through the boring parts, but I realized it's all going to be boring parts. So I'm just going to kind of show you my progress as time goes by. This is like a week's worth of work. So in another week, you know, and this was slow going because this was just me kind of conceptualized what I was doing. So it'll probably go a lot faster than this. So uh, just kind of stay tuned. If you're a fan of Final Fantasy or just a fan of castles like I really am, then uh, you'll be able to see how it goes. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.